Hi guys, Matt from 123MyIT here. Welcome to the channel. Have you or a family member forgotten the passcode on your iPhone or iPad? Are you getting the iPhone unavailable message coming up? Well, in this video, we'll take a look at a few ways that you can bypass the iPhone unavailable message. Let's take a look. Okay guys, so the first tip that I wanna share with you is just to try using your muscle memory. So what you will do is you'll take your phone, don't think about it, put it down for 15 minutes, come back and don't try not to think about the passcode, but just let your just let the muscle memory of your hand or your thumb or your finger or whatever you normally use to unlock the phone, unlock the phone. Uh, five times out of 10, this will work. It, it just without thinking about it, your muscle memory will just remember the code. If you can't remember your passcode, then the next step here is to erase your iPhone and I'll show you how to do that now. If you enter the incorrect passcode several times, the device should take you to the security lockout screen. Once you are on that screen, Apple offers an option to erase the phone without using a passcode. Go ahead and tap on erase iPhone or iPad. If you erase the device, it will wipe all the data on your iPhone or iPad. The reason it wipes the data is because, say, let's say you lost your iPhone or it was stolen, then your data cannot be accessed. Enter your Apple ID password. Cool. Now it should reset and you should be able to set it up again like a new iPhone or iPad. If this doesn't work on some older devices, then you will need to do a reset with a Mac or a Windows PC with iTunes installed. I'll show you how to do that now. Plug your iPhone or iPad into a Mac or PC with a lightning cable that came with your device. You will need to put your device into DFU mode or recovery mode. I will show you how to do it in case you missed it. So press the volume up button and then press the volume down button and then press and hold the power button and just don't let go of it. And then that will put it into the recovery mode. Cool, there you go. So you can see there's the recovery mode and it shows up on the Mac in the background. You wanna press restore and then restore and update. It will go out to the Apple servers and download a version of the iPhone or iPad iOS firmware. And then it will unpack it and it will install it on your device. Awesome, so the firmware has downloaded and installed now and the passcode has been removed and you can go ahead and set up your iPhone without a passcode now. Guys, I hope that video helped out and you're able to get past the iPhone unavailable screen. If you didn't get past the iPhone unavailable screen, then please leave a comment in the comments section below. Also, if you could leave a thumbs up on the video, that really helps out. And don't forget to smash that subscribe button and the bell icon. Catch you later, guys. Bye-bye.